Yeah. Gavin Robinson. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. One of the consequences of not having a functioning executive is that there has been no political oversight of the scandal of Muckamore Abbey. I have raised it personally with the Secretary of State. I have written to the Secretary of State. She knows that we had a sanctuary for adults with learning difficulties and they were physically abused and assaulted by nursing staff on Friday. The nurses had their suspensions overturned. Why? Because appallingly the Belfast Trust have not provided the evidence in the CCTV to the Nursing and Midwifery Council. This is a scandal and it hasn't had full consideration here and it certainly isn't going to get it without Stormont at home. The Secretary of State knows that through the Inquiries Act she is the only person who is capable of calling a public inquiry. Without a minister, she is the one person uh, who can do it. Can I ask her to earnestly engage with the Department of Health in Northern Ireland, with the families and those who need to see answers for the failure that we have had in caring for those who need such yeah, significant yeah, care? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mr Speaker, the Honourable Gentleman has indeed raised this issue with me on a number of occasions. It is truly shocking. And uh, the reports that we are all seeing coming from victims are ones that nobody should have to read and, and, uh, and see. He makes the point also that ministers in Stormont would be able to make decisions and, and deal with this matter, but I will continue to consider the points he's made and uh, review the position. 